，亲爱的五 G 八让选区选民，大家晚上好。首先，让我感谢大家参加我们人民行动党今天的行动大会，谢谢。时间过得非常快，我已经在五军班乱区为大家服务了十四年，真的非常快，十四年了。当我在一九九六年来到五军班乱时，五军班乱那时候还是一个新镇，当时的新镇的公共设施也非常有限。在我进行家访时，许多居民都要求增加更多的公共设施，例如学校、直筒评价超市、购物中心、斯巴沙以及游泳池等等的设施。这些年来，居民和我。建立了非常紧密的合作关系，共同进行改善和增加各个公共设施。我们增建了许多学校，其中也是这些新的学校：振华中学、斯巴沙，在发家有一间斯巴沙，过中心、直种评价超市。以及最近刚开的游泳池，在过去的十四年里，有很多居民和医务工作者都成了我的好朋友。我们建立了良好关系，大家可以坦诚的讨论各种课题，居民和我之间的。紧密关系，使我更努力的去争取和进一步改善他们的生活。今天，所有五居班让的居民，也能够居住在这个市镇，而感到自豪。我们已经为居民建立了一个伟大。而充满活力的家园，大家同意吗？五七八二是一个伟大的家园，是不是？在上一届的大选大选时，我许下诺言，为我们的居民翻新祖屋的电梯。这项计划得到了九十多八千以上的居民大力支持，而我们也成为新加坡一个为一百三十二座主屋进行电梯翻新的选区。恭喜你们，恭喜！居民们对他们的祖屋增添了新电梯电梯，而感到非常的高兴。最近我访问居民的时候，很多居民都说，电梯方新使到他们更方便，电梯能够停在每一层楼，他们感到非常的好，非常的方便。我们也打造了一个一百八千无障碍的市镇。在这么多年里，我们建了很多斜坡走道和扶手，让上了年纪和行动不方便的居民可以协助这些设备通行无阻的达到镇内的每一个地方。同时，我们也建了非常多的有盖走廊，连接。镇内所有不同分区的组
，骑士五级棒浪是在新加坡唯一的一个选区，有最多的有盖主郎。每次我到访问，我每次我访问居民的时候，他们都会要求在哪一个地点要连接起来，要建有盖主郎。因为孩子们、家人要用到一些走道，如果下雨的时候，他们感到不大方便。因此，市政理事会在这些年里都建了非常多的有盖走廊，而且带给居民相当大的方便。五七八浪能成为一个充满活力的社区。主要有三个大点，第一点就是就是在五级班上，我们非常幸运，有很多肯为居民服务的好义工。到目前为止，我们大约有一千位的义工为我们的社区提供各种服务和活动。第二点。五级班的居民也非常的活跃，无论是年长或是年少，年少的都非常支持我们社区的活动。其中一项最受欢迎的活动就是我们西北区轻快步行俱乐部，大约有七千多位居民参与这项轻快步行活动，来保持。身体强壮和健康，这项活动进一步加强了五级班浪居民的钢板精神。第三点，主要的、最主要，我们有一个充满爱心的社区，我们的福利小组的义工们都为有需要的居民提供协助。这些年来，我们帮助了大约三千三百名急需协助的家庭，他们也为贫困学生提供助学金、补习津贴以及上学的零用钱。同时，我们也协助了一千两百位居民寻找到工作。亲爱的选民，我们未来五年的八大计划是：第一，我们会在大牌二五九建立座新的巴沙及熟食中心；第二，我们将会建五金班五金班站的地铁站及巴士转换中心。第三个计划就是，我们将会建一个五级班的综合中心，在地铁站的附近。第四，就是我们有很多居民都很喜欢种菜、种花、种药草，我们将会在每一个邻里都建一个菜园，给我们的居民，好不好？五级办案区也是大概是属于一个比较熟成熟的的区，大约这里足有大概二十多年。政府也会进行我们的邻里的更新计划，我们会在每一个邻里去更新跟改善整个邻里的环境。第六个计划就是我们也会在大牌二七六的对面。建一个非常大的自然公园，因为我们是整个区要更进一步的绿化。这个公园是在我们快速公路的对面，是一个非常大的自然公园。第七就是我在这里十四年的，在这十四年里，五级八万的居民也是在这里的车辆也是增加了非常多。在未来的五年，我们会增加更多的停车位给我们的居民。第八项计划就是，我们也会进行一些市政改善计划，例如
增添一些油盖阻拦，或者是遮掩停处等等，给居民使用。要实现这些新计划，我们需要居民和政府大力的支持与合作。这五十年里，人民行动党政府为新加坡提供了良好的治国方针。在此，我要感谢。大家这些年来的支持，让我们一起努力，共创美好的未来，好不好？好不好？请投人民行动党一票，谢谢。Thank you, Dr. Chiu. Dear voters of Bukit Panjang SMC and Holland Bukit Timah GRC, time passes fast. I've been here in Bukit Panjang for 14 years, serving our residents as your member of parliament. Let me first thank all of our residents for the strong support you have given me over the years. Over the years, your strong support has given a lot of encouragement for me to work harder to serve you better. Everyone in Bukit Panjang knows that I work hard, I work with the residents, I listen to the residents' needs and concerns. I pay them visits. I've been to the house, the flats, many times. The main purpose is to understand what are their needs, their concerns, and explore solutions to help and better serve our residents. When I first came to Bukit Panjang in 1996, Bukit Panjang was a new town. At that time, there were not many amenities. When I first did my first block visit, I got up one whole shopping list from our residents. Residents felt that they do not have many facilities. But today, Bukit Panjang has a full range of facilities. We have so many primary schools, we have secondary schools, we have wet market, shopping center, upcoming MRT station, we have LRT and also many other facilities in our neighborhood. Over the years, i worked very closely with our volunteers and our residents. And many of them have actually become my good friends. I think it is this strong rapport, the relationship between myself, my volunteers, and my residents that has strengthened the bond of our people. Today, Bukit Panjang residents take pride to be staying in this town. We have, over the years, built a great home and a vibrant community for all our residents. Why is Bukit Panjang a great home? We are the first constituency to have upgraded all the blocks which are eligible for leaf upgrading. A total of 132 blocks have undergone leaf upgrading providing leaves to stop at every floor. This morning I visited one block, block 106. One resident on a wheelchair thanked me. He said, lucky thing, we upgraded the leaves three years ago. If not, she will not be able to get up and get out of the house. The husband was very grateful that we have this foresight and we implemented the leaf upgrading program. Many residents have given me feedback that the leaf upgrading program has indeed brought a lot of convenience to our residents. The second thing is that in Bukit Panjang Town, we are 100% barrier free. Over the years, we have placed a lot of emphasis to make sure that every part of the town is barrier free, is accessible to our residents, young, old, handicapped, those who are not so mobile, we want to make sure that it is an inclusive town where everyone can move along, around very conveniently. And that's the reason why we have provided better free access, we have provided lots of covering ways for residents. When I took over as town council chairman in 2001, my first priority is to build a barrier-free, seamless town in Bukit Panjang. Over the last 10 years, 
A lot of our resources have been invested in building barrier free access and covered lingways and noble points. That's why today, if you look at Phuket Panjang Town, we are one and the only town that has got many covered lingways and barrier free access. Besides a, new, uh, a good town, a great home, we also have a vibrant community. We have very active residents who come out very regularly to participate in our community activities. And I must thank all the volunteers for helping us to reach out to the residents. Together, we can build a strong community in Bukit Panjang. Besides a vibrant community, we are also a caring community. And we have helped many needy residents in our constituency. Last but not least, let me just share with you eight projects we are doing for the next five years. We are building a new wet market and food centre at Block 259. You know that the MRT station is coming out with a bus interchange integrated. We are going to build a Bukit Panjang integrated hub. And we will be providing or building community gardens in every single precinct in our neighbourhood. We have a number of neighbourhood renewal programs and we are going to have a big nature park just beside the BKE. And of course, we want to address the car park lots. We want to add more car park lots for our residents because uh, over the years the car population has increased and we want to provide more lots for our residents. Besides that, we'll be doing a few more improvement projects to make our town more seamless and vibrant. With that, once again, let me thank all of you and I hope you will continue to support me and vote for PAP. Vote PAP! Thank you.